good morning students it is first year maths and uh, little i want to say that it is due to this tremendous pressure of this online uh, offline classes and that is due to result also that is that's a great a problem so uh, homework i will check on thursday and attendance also i will maintain i will make this one and don't worry i will give the attendance also now today we will uh, do the remaining sum of the exercise and those sum which we are not able to, we not do that you try to do at home and you can ask for this one and yes so definitely i will give this reply after thursday uh, thursday i can give the reply so 26 you can do and 27 let is 27 they have said that find limit fx x tends to 5 where fx equal to modulus x minus 5 fx equal to modulus x minus 5 and we have to find what limit fx x tends to 5 the students you see that when modulus sign is there you have to break this and for that modulus x always can be written in the form x minus 5 if x is greater than or equal to 0 and minus x minus 5 if x less than 0 now what is the logic behind that that i have written modulus x as x because if x is 0 or positive then modulus has no meaning you can write instead of modulus x x only but suppose if x is less than 0 that is negative then what will be the value of the modulus x modulus x will suppose minus 2 if i put inside the modulus minus 2 then it will become plus 2 shall i think that modulus has given another minus and make it positive that the technique that if it is negative then we have to put on minus before that so that it become positive so that is the thing ekane eta use korechi je modulus ta keno amra x e liklam karon x jokhon 0 ba tar theke boro hoy kabhi bhi x 0 0 or 0 se boro ho tokhon ki hoy tar bilu to same thake modulus 2 2 hobe modulus 0 0 hobe to uska koi change nahi hota agar ye positive ya 0 ho लेकिन मॉडुलस का तभी रिएक्शन होता है मॉडुलस से तो कौन ही होगे जो कौन क्या होए उटा नेगेटिव होए जब उन माइनस थी मॉडुलस से बोला ले उटा प्लस थी होए तार माने कि उटा अरे एक टा माइनस दिए उटा के प्लस कर दिए थे सो दैट इज़ द टेक्निक यू हैव टू रिमेम्बर दैट टेक्निक आल्सो नाउ इफ x tends to 5 minus fx x tends to 5 minus means what that is x is little bit less than 5 x little bit less than 5 means what is it greater than this one shall i take because this is what all the values of x for when x greater than equal to 0 of course we will take this one as limit x tends to 5 and our value will be x minus 5 if we would do this limit then it will 5 minus 5 that is 0 so our left hand limit is 0 now right hand limit here right hand limit means 5 plus 5 plus here means little bit bigger than 5 now if we little take little bigger than 5 still it is greater than 0 so it is x tends to 5 x minus 5 if we do the limit 5 minus 5 0 therefore LHL is equal to RHL is equal to 0 therefore limit fx x tends to 5 is equal to 0 so this is the technique of finding the values of this limit what I have done here First I have broken the modulus, then I have written the LHL, then I have written the RHL 
and I have written LHL is equal to one HL is equal to zero. So this is our answer of question number twenty-seven. Now twenty-eight we are going to do. Question number twenty-two. They say it suppose f x equal to a x plus a plus b x x less than one. And it is four if x equal to one, b minus x if x greater than one. If limit f x x tends to one and equal to f one, what are the possible values of a and b? So here question f x what we will write f x is a plus b x, and it is when x less than one is equal to four if x equal to one, b minus x if x greater than one. Also, they have given limit f x x tends to one is equal to f one. Here, as this given means is L H L is equal to R H L is equal to f one. So this means limit x tends to one minus f x. This is L H L of this term is equal to limit x tends to one plus f x this is r h l of that term f 1 x 1 1 f x is 4 limit x tends to 1 if 1 is little less than x is little less than 1 then value will be f x will be a plus b x if x is little greater than 1 then f x will be b minus a x is equal to 4. Now if you draw the limit a plus x is 1 so b if you draw the limit then b minus a into 1 is a is equal to 4. Now students if we consider this one then we will get a plus b is equal to b minus a b we cancel we get twice a is equal to 0 so a is 0 if we consider this one b minus a is equal to 4 if we put a is equal to 0 b is 4 so how do we get a is 0 and b is 4 so i think no need to explain in other language it is well explained like that so now we will do question number 29 <coughs> limit x tends to a1 fx they have said you find this one and also they said that uh, fx is they have given x minus a1 x minus a2 x minus a n now limit if we would draw then x you will replace by a1 if we write a1 minus a1 a1 minus a2 a1 minus a n a1 minus a1 is 0 0 into anything is 0 so your value is this now they again say to find limit f x when x tends to a another value they have said limit f x x tends to a so as limit f x is given as x minus a1 x minus a2 x minus a1 it is a simple one if you draw the limit then a minus a1 a minus a2 a minus a n. So this is our value of limit f x x tends to a. So this is the answer. Now question number 30. Thirty. They say it find the values of a limit f x x tends to. So students, I want to do the remaining three in the next classes. You just uh, think of this one. Today's what we have done. 
and it is not so tough some and of course I expect that uh, you can do and let me also be a little free so that we can start derivative derivative so definitely one day after tomorrow we have to start and nicely you have to explain what is derivative and what is let's finish that tomorrow limit and you can uh, ask or can send any question if you have that much for today